Hey guys, Ernie here. Welcome to the Paleo Maker MD channel. As you see behind me, I've got these metal pegboards. And one of the things that I wanted to do was uh, display and kind of hang a lot of the things that, that kind of inspire me. The kind of things that make me want to make videos, uh, just things that, that I enjoy having around. Now, a lot of those things are knives. I like to have knives. I, I collect them, quite a few of them. And it's one of those things where I really wanted the ability to just kind of reach out, grab one, do whatever I wanted to do and I couldn't find a good way to hang up my knives on a pegboard. So I decided to go ahead and make my own hanger. I'll show you guys today what it looks like. You'll also have the opportunity to download it and print it on your own 3D printer for free if you want to. Stay tuned, I'll show you guys what I came up with. So this is how it comes off of the printer. I'll show you real quick what it looked like on a time lapse to, to go ahead and print this thing. So there's two parts. Okay, um, the first is just getting off these side pieces, okay, on the back, I should say, which is how it connects to, there we go, it's good to have a nice little set of pliers. This is how it connects to the pegboard in the back. Just pop this off. And there's the back piece that connects it to the pegboard, and this top part just pops right off. Just like that. And there is your finished piece. Give you just a little bit closer look at what it looks like. There's the back, okay? That's what pops on to the pegboard. The knife will slide over top right here. There's distance, plenty of room, about a quarter of an inch room in there for something to slide in. So for example, if you have this Right here, it'll slide right in to the back, just like that, and you can hang it. Let me show you what it looks like up on the pegboard. All right, so here's our piece right here, and it just pops on, okay? Real simple, make sure I'm in frame there for you guys. Just pops really, really strongly on there. So there it is, and the way this works, take for example this knife right here. This is a custom knife by Tom Chitwood. Who used to be on YouTube okay there it is a beautiful knife and this was made by Jeremiah who was also on YouTube unfortunately passed away um, he was country prepper here on YouTube and he made some awesome kydex sheets but anyway you can see the little loop here so all of a sudden you want to hang this knife on here you just get this little loop and it has just enough room behind there for this to go behind it and boom there you go hangs up perfectly just like that want to take it off just slide it out easy as it gets that is a super slick and easy way to hang up a knife with some kind of a sheath loop like this pops right in you'll notice just how thick this leather is okay you can see it's pretty thick i'll tell you 964 thick try down here where it's a little closer so 1 8 is what it really started so it's 1 8 thick eighth of an inch and it's got plenty of room to slide behind there. That is how I hang my knives onto these metal pegboards.
Yep, mmm, that is good. So that is a look at this little hanger that I made. Again, it's uh, it, it can basically hang any uh, any sheath that has some kind of a little loop. Most of them are going to be leather. They could also be a uh, cordage or whatever, anything. You can really hang anything you want off of it that you need to hang on like that vertical plane. This was printed. I've printed a bunch of them uh, on my 3D printer. If you don't have a 3D printer, maybe you have a friend who has a 3D printer and you can download the file down below. If, um, if you have a, a library, a lot of times they'll have 3D printers available. So it doesn't mean you can't print it if you don't have a 3D printer. I have a couple of other videos on 3D printing, which I'll leave links down below. I think one of them is on my main channel, the Paleo Hiker MD channel, and one is here on this channel. I have essentially zero experience designing stuff on Fusion 360. I just sat down and said, what can I make that would allow me to hang uh, a knife like this on a pegboard? And that's where I designed it, and it works extremely well. If you're interested in the 3D printer, I have the Ender Creality, or the Creality Ender 3 Pro, and it is, it's like 220 bucks, I think, uh, to get started. Uh, buy yourself a $20 uh, reel of PLA, and you're off to the races printing. Down below, there is a link to Thingiverse. Thingiverse is kind of a community where people share their uh, designs mainly for free. Mine is certainly up there for free, and I'll be making more designs over time. But if you're interested and you 3D print, you'll know what I'm talking about. Just go down there to that Thingiverse link, and you can download this particular um, design. If you do uh, download it and make it, do me a favor, uh, get on there and, and comment on Thingiverse. If you decide to make it and put it on Instagram, I am on Instagram, it's at PaleoHikerMD. Just tag me with the hashtag PaleoHikerMD and I'll uh, check it out and see what you guys uh, come up with. It's really, really cool. I appreciate everyone's support. I'm starting to try to build this new channel. Hope you guys enjoyed this particular project. Um, just trying to continue to make this new space my own and having things out to kind of inspire me, uh, make me think about videos, make me think about the things that I want to do is very helpful. So once again, check down below. As always, I appreciate y'all checking out the Paleo Maker MD channel. Stay tuned for more videos. See you soon, guys.